body bags were Horlies. Hey, what's going on, everybody? Uh, welcome to Monday's edition of Body Bags. Um, today, I'm going to review a new film that I just purchased, and you can get it at Walmart if you have a Walmart near you, or you can order it online. But it is a film called Duress. Hopefully you guys can see that. Okay, this is 76 minutes long and it stars um, Catherine Dent, Gina Calego, Billy Worth, and Ariel Winter. Okay. Alright, anyway, what this movie is about is a man named Richard who is has a daughter, her her name, his daughter's name was Sarah. Um, both of them are kind of suffering from sort of a depression because of the loss of his wife and her mother. Uh, she died. And it doesn't really tell you how until, you know, further into the film. But it's a very short film. Like I said, it's only 76 minutes. But <clears throat> basically, Richard, one night uh, after work, stops at a donut shop. And another man by the name of Abner... Uh, walks into the donut shop as well. Um, as soon as the guy that works at the donut shop, shop comes out, basically Abner hits the guy in the face while Richard is there. And um, he basically kills the, 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 the worker at the donut shop. Um, and the, the whole movie is, is kind of like... Uh, Abner is making Richard do certain things for him and making him keep his mouth shut. If he doesn't, he's going to basically kidnap Sarah and do bad things to his daughter. So the whole plot of this movie is uh, kind of like what the tagline says on it. It's, uh, what would you do to save your child? Um, Abner makes Richard do several things, witness several things, and... Uh, it basically puts him to the test to see if he can, uh, you know, keep his mouth shut and do whatever he has to do to make sure his daughter remains safe. That's basically the plot of the film. Um, this is kind of more like a psychological, or not a psychological thriller, I'm sorry, a suspense thriller. Um, but if you have children, it's more of a horror film for you. Being that I have a daughter and a son... Uh, this would be something that would be horrendous to me. I mean, not horrendous, but I mean, it would be horror. It would, it would, it would, it would basically scare the living shit out of me. Um, I was pleasantly surprised by this film. Now it does drag a little bit, especially for being 76 minutes, but there's a lot of character development between Abner and Richard and Sarah. And, um... All in all, it's a, it's a fucking great film, in my opinion. And I'm going to tell you now, the ending blew me away. I did not see the ending coming. And wow, I was highly, highly, highly impressed with this film. If you guys have not seen this, this is a must-get, a must-see. Um, for for being such a short film out of five, this, this gets a 4.5, in my opinion. That's just my personal opinion, and if you don't like it, you know, if you don't, I mean, if you don't like the film, I can understand, but in my opinion, this is a fucking great film. I'm, I'm, wow. The ending just, wow. I don't want to say anything or spoil it, you just, you have to see this film. Uh, there's not much more to say without spoiling this guy, so basically that's my review for you guys. Uh, get the rest, or at least rent it. Uh, it's a must-see. All right, guys, I'll see you next week, I believe, is theme week. Uh, I think they're doing we're doing shot on video. But, um, yeah, uh, see you guys next week. Deuces.